What is leadership? I think leadership is, um, I was elected by the people of this county. Um, they say you're not supposed to have an opinion, but I was elected by the people to do a job. And I am over, last year we managed $72 million. And I'll never see $72 million in my life, folks. That's a lot of money. And you have to be on your toes. You elected me to watch over that money. And at the end, I'm going to tell you a few things that I've been able to do since I've been in office. And, you know, I am I just feel like I need to do the right thing. And I've always tried to stand up for what's right. You may not always like what I say, but I've always been honest, and I've always done what's right. And my books have balanced to the penny for nine years and ten months. I've never written off one penny in that office. So I think I've taken some leadership and I've stood up for you as a taxpayer and I've done what's right for you. What is leadership, Brandon? Well, leadership is somebody who would uh, take the lead and show the way for other people. And in our county, I think the uh, treasurer's office is a role that uh, takes directions from the uh, commissioners and uh, provides the necessary uh, uh, skills, you know, writes the checks, provides the bookkeeping uh, for the county. And that falls under the direction of the commissioners and the county government. Anything like that? Yes, I would. Uh, yes, we do take direction from the county commission, and I do that any time I've asked. I've always done what the county commission has asked me to. Um, but we also have laws that we have to abide by. And I can tell you a couple of incidences where it's a good thing I did not do what the county commission asked me to do, and I questioned that. Right after I was elected, the last time, in October of 2008, I was given a form that the presiding commissioner at the time had signed off on, the county auditor had put our banking information on, and I was given that sheet of paper and told to fax that on back. And it was, in order to see procurements from the federal government, we were supposed to turn in our banking information. I didn't think it was right. And because I questioned that, I say this county, you all that are sitting here, a $4 million scam. I went on a federal website. I exact letter was on that website and it said this is a fraudulent letter. Do not respond to it. So I call that leadership and stepping up to the plate and doing what's right. I don't have anything to add. Okay.